Thanks, uh, Bob, ladies and gentlemen. The official New Zealand temperature record tells us that the temperature has warmed by approximately one degree during the course of the 20th century. This was published in 1999 by NEWA and came as uh, something of a surprise to a number of people who are now members of the New Zealand uh, Climate Science Coalition. That's partly because there had been a, uh, a well-respected meteorologist, the most senior meteorologist in New Zealand at the time, had written a peer-reviewed published paper in 1980 which said that there had been no global warming, no uh, warming trend in New Zealand between 1930 and 1980. <coughs> uh, there was that difficulty to uh, uh, reconcile that with the, the new, newer uh, trend line of one degree over the century. The Minister had told the Parliament on an occasion that New Zealand would expect that its warming would be about a third less than the global warming because we were surrounded by seas and insulated to some degree. But the one degree, of course, is more than the global warming uh, experienced over the course of the century, and it didn't correlate with the global pattern that we've seen two or three times during the course of the day. The up and down that occurred with the rest of the world was very different from the shape of the curve in New Zealand. One of our oldest members, Vincent Gray, had a report from the Royal Society when it was first founded, uh, which related the fact that New Zealand had an average temperature in 1867 of a figure which was half a degree warmer than it is now. So how could it have been, how could we have increased by uh, a degree over the course of the 20th century uh, when in fact it was half a degree warmer in 1867 than it is in, 1909, in 2009. We received from the uh, California University's library uh, a, a document that there's no record of in New Zealand which set out from the Dominion meteorologist New Zealand's temperatures for the period 1863 to 1920. These two indicated that it was warmer in those days than it is now. Various cities had uh, record temperatures in their, uh, their city uh, chronicles. Very few of them had records in recent times. Most of these records were back in the 1920s and the 1930s. So all of these things pointed to the fact that there was something strange about the newer official New Zealand record. The members of the coalition managed to download the raw data that is in the climate database, which became available in 2007 and compared that with the NEWA record and discovered that all of the warming over the 100 years was all on account of adjustments that had been made to the initial data. So they published this in a paper form, just put it up on the web, uh, unable to obtain anybody to, uh, to run it within the mainstream media. Uh, a paper called Are We Feeling Warm Yet? Uh, which simply pointed at which point simply at which 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 simply at which
which massively, massively, 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 which mass
which